week from now, I gotta compete in one of the biggest VR tournaments. The problem is, I have never played No More Rainbows before. I'm gonna try to, oh, and he gets a double kill. For day one, my plan was to learn the mode and I grabbed a couple of No More Rainbows content creators, help me out. You guys are some of the, the goats at this game. I've done at least an hour of practice, okay? My goal is to not go out in the first round. And the countdown started for my first ever round in this game. Let's do it, let's do it. Oh, oh, that seems scary. I have the sword, bruh. The brand new sword that was added in this deathmatch update. <laughs> it was fun for the first three seconds, but... No! No! I was not winning. After playing for about an hour of just consecutive losing, I didn't even get a single point. I realized that my work might be cut out for me. Guys, I'm starting to think I might not have a chance. The next day, I hopped into public lobbies to try to get a feel of the maps and items. How is he not dying? Yes! Let's go! And throughout the rest of the week, I kept putting in the work playing for at least 30 minutes to one hour a day. I need to play more games and improving my aim as I was playing. It is now 24 hours before the event, and I just got assigned to my group. I'm not feeling very good right now. So we got BMT, has been Official Lemon, and me. And I'm starting to lose faith here, if I'll even be able to make it to the second round. The team over at Squido Studio wanted me to let you guys know that they're releasing a scary backrooms update for No More Ramos that is out for a limited time starting today. I think there's a monster down there, so be careful. All right, so we are literally like three hours away from the tournament. I'm gonna get some final practice in and see what we can do. My last case went well, and I sat eagerly awaiting my pool in the tournament. When waiting, Eric brought up a detail I did not know beforehand. Third matchup is BMT, Official Lemon, Majora. And, and I have to say this, one of the highest, most kills player of No More Rainbows is Hasbeen. And I'm not saying this because I'm biased. Hasbeen has played the crap out of No More Rainbows. So knowing this fact, all my hope kind of eviscerated, but I still tried to pull everyone's energy. Everyone in the chat, let me your energy. Each pool of the tournament is divided into three rounds, with the top two advancing out of their pools into the semifinals on the next day. Also, if you haven't already, I'm trying to hit 50,000 subscribers by the end of 2023. So even if I can't beat Hasbeen, I just need to outscore BMT and Official Lemon. Now that the stage was set, it was time for the first round. Ooh, a little bit of a solo death, and it took me a really long time to secure my first kill. Holy! Hey, worth it. Throwing some berries around. Oh! No shot. Yes. The knockdown running for his life. Oh, he's saving my. Oh my goodness! Saving himself right off the edge. He's gonna be able to save himself again, and he saves himself again. Dude, I am not stacking up the kills right now, though. Suicide! Let's go! Let's go! For some reason, me and PFT kept colliding into each other. Where you at? Come here! Dude, my head's shaking. Why is my head shaking? Come here! No! Oh no! Raw! There's so many spike balls everywhere! No! The first round ended with everyone at around the same points, but a huge problem was lurking around the corner. When the second round started, the map that we played on was the only map in the game that I have not played on yet. Oh, this, wait, look at the lips on that thing. Holy crap. Wait, I'm not dead here, right? I'm just kind of, no way, no way. The lack of game knowledge was not helping me. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. No way, no way. Really, don't do it. I know that's karma. After a disappointing second round, I was falling behind on kills with everybody else. I don't want to be that guy, but this might be a little, little rigged. They drafted us with the Shaq and Kobe of this game, and I would need to show up in the last round to win. So I unleash the dog. Cause I got that dog in me, dude. What? Dog in me. I got that dog in me. Everyone was struggling a lot with getting kills early. So there was still hope. <laughs> Yo, I killed myself. You know what? I killed myself. But then something lit a fire in my heart and I decided to lock in. Let's go. Let's go. Work. Okay. 
Yeah, Majora okay. going in on Hasbin. Gonna try to. Oh, he gets a double kill. That was great from Majora. And the game ending in 10 seconds. In 10 seconds. I need one. I just need one. That's it. Okay. I actually don't know. I actually don't know. You know what? Guys, regardless, it was a fun little romp. You know, that's all that matters. Eric announced the order of the bracket and who won. I'm going to start from the bottom this time. So in fourth place, we have Majora with 10 points. No! No way! Yo, I'm the king. I'm the king anyways, though. The king of the pirates. Yes, I'm the king of the pirates. So there was a miscalculation of the votes to where I was ahead of BMT. So at least I have that. But regardless, I enjoyed my time playing this game despite not winning. And at the end of the day, I had fun. Uh